trucking from Canada to the U.S. today. And the supply chain issue, it's straight day, trucking protests blocked a border crossing from Canada to the U.S. today. And the supply chain issues are building up. WBZ's Christina Hager spoke with truckers in Massachusetts who believe this blockade is doing more harm than good. Truck driver Lionel Lemming is headed with a load to Buffalo. What he had not planned on, that's exactly where other truckers are organizing to converge in support of the truck blockade at the Canadian border. I'll probably dance around it. They're there in protest of pandemic restrictions. I feel like we, have, you know, we're we're a valuable uh, asset to, to getting everything going, and I just feel like they're just hindering the progress. This as the convoy along the Michigan border, the center of the U.S. auto industry, begins to impact auto parts supplies. I've seen more and more in my system of no availability than I've ever seen before. Mark Winters works at Napa Auto Parts in Brockton. It was something I would have to order. He's been struggling with supply shortages throughout the pandemic. Usually the shelves are full, completely stocked full. To now face more possible fallout is frustrating. We're stretched thin sometimes, and it seems like we're buying from places we may have never reached out to before. There are even groups in Massachusetts popping up on social media organizing to support protesting truckers. But experts say the real threat is what could trickle down to consumers like you and me. Anything that hinders trade at the moment? Boston University <laughs> economics professor Tarek Hassan. If you go to a car dealer and you say you want a new car, and they don't have any, they can either tell you, well, you have to wait or you have to pay more. It's making it harder on us because less drivers means we got to go back and forth to job site. Lemming has no plans to join anything like this. Instead, he says he'll be picking up the slack. Christina Hager, WBZ News. Fucking rat scum. Pieces of shit. Big as a rat scum comes from fucking Massachusetts, too. Pieces of shit. Fucking, ugh, makes me want to fucking puke. Really. They really fucking suck. Support the Canadian protest, believe me. Fucking the only ones that got any balls, if it's real.